Hello guys what's up, so I'm back again for another tutorial video. So in this video, I will gonna show you how you can download the Bybit app on your PC or laptop, so if you are interested then keep on watching. But before all that, if you are new to my channel consider to like and subscribe for more videos like this, and also, you can comment down below if you have something that you want me to make a tutorial about. So without further ado, let's start the tutorial. So to download the Bybit app on your PC or laptop, it's actually pretty easy, just follow what I'm gonna do. So for the first step, I want you to go to your Microsoft Edge browser. Reminder guys, you can't use any other web browser, you must only use Microsoft Edge in order for this to work, but if you don't have a Microsoft Edge, you can download it on Chrome easily, just search for Microsoft Edge download and then you will now be able to find the website where you can download it. And once you already have your Microsoft Edge, just go and open it. And once you're on your Microsoft Edge, next, you will need to go to the official website of Bybit, since that's where we will download the app, so just search this on your search bar. Make sure to enter it correctly so you will be directed to the website. And now that you're on the official website of Bybit, let me now show you how to download the app. So to do that, first, I want you to click this three dots at the top. And after clicking it, I want you to select this more tools option right here. And then select the apps option. And after that, there it is guys. You will now see the install this site as an app option right here. Just go and click it. And then just rename this as Bybit. Then click the install button once again. And after that, it's done. Congratulations. You will now have your Bybit installed on your PC or laptop. So just log in or create your account and then you will be able to use it. And by the way guys, you might notice that even after installing Bybit, you might still not find the app on your desktop home screen. So to fix that, just go back to the app. And once you're on the app, I want you to click this three dots right here. And then select app settings. And finally, for the last step, just click this create desktop shortcut button to add the app to your desktop home screen. And after clicking it, it's done, congratulations, you will now have the app added to your desktop home screen, so you can now access it more easily in the future. And so that's just how you do it guys, now that you've watched this video you can now do it yourself. So that concludes our tutorial video for today, I hope it helped you, thanks for watching, goodbye.